In this video, I will show you how to duplicate a SharePoint list. Start by navigating to your SharePoint site and opening the list you want to duplicate. Once the list is open, you'll see all the data it contains. If you want to duplicate only the structure of the list without the data, you can do this directly within SharePoint. Click on the Home section from the left side of your screen, then click on the New option. From the drop-down menu, select List. Next, click on From Existing List. You'll see a list of all the sites you have access to. Select the site where your original list is located and click Next. Enter a name for your new list and click Create. The new list will be created with the same columns as the original list, but without any data. If you want to duplicate the list along with all its data, you'll need to use Excel as an intermediary. Start by exporting the original list to Excel. Click on the Export option in the List toolbar and select Export to Excel. This will download an Excel file containing all the data from your list. Open the downloaded file by right-clicking on it, selecting Open With and choosing Excel. If this pop-up appears, click Enable. Once the file is open, click on the File option at the top left corner of the screen and select Save As. Save the file to your computer. Now, return to your SharePoint site. To create a new list with the exported data, click on the Home section again, then click on New and select List. This time, choose the From Excel option. Click on Upload File and select the Excel file you just saved. SharePoint will process the file, which may take a few moments depending on its size. Once the upload is complete, click Next, enter a name for your new list, and click Create. SharePoint will create a new list with all the data from the Excel file. After the list is created, you may notice some extra columns that were not in the original list. To remove these, hover your mouse over the column header and click on the drop-down arrow, select Column Settings, and then Edit. Click on Delete and confirm the deletion. Repeat this process for any unnecessary columns. Once you've cleaned up the list, you'll have an exact duplicate of the original list, including all its data.